In this video, I want to have a look into the Format Painter in Power BI together with you. If you have experience in Excel, you maybe know the Format Painter. It's this really nice button that you click and then in Excel applies the same format to, for example, one cell to another cell. Well, in Power BI, it kind of works the same, but we can format like visuals. Let's say we have a card visual and then we have a card visual that we want to look like the first card visual. We can apply the Format Painter and just well, format it the same way. But the nice thing is we can also do this for multiple visuals. So let's say we have three card visuals and we want to apply the same formatting. There's a little workaround. Sometimes we need to use some workarounds to make things work, but it works. I will show you how to do that. And another thing that I really like about the Format Painter is that you can use the format of one visual on another visual, even if it's not the same visual. So I, for example, have a bar chart and a column chart. I can apply it from the bar chart to the column chart. Little side note, this only works if the first visual, the configuration of the visual, is kind of the same as the configuration of the second visual. Like some visuals are very different, like let's say a column chart and a table. We can still use the format painter. And for example, the background, the border, these kind of things, probably I will pick up. But other stuff like conditional formattings of the bars or columns. Probably I will not pick up in, well, the table or matrix because, well, there are no columns or bars in there. So that's important to know. Enough of the talking. I'm going to show you this in Power BI. Here we are in Power BI. Now, this is very basic. We see four card visuals at the top and the first one has the formatting I really like. It has a border, background, there's a certain font and a certain font size. And I want that to be applied to the other card visual. I click on my card visual and I go to the Format Painter. You can see it here at the top. It's in the Home section of the ribbon in the Report view. There's the Format Painter. So I click on my card visual, then I click on the Format Painter and I click on the card visual that I want to format. And you see it applies automatically the same formatting. Now let's turn that back. I already told you maybe I don't want to click on this and then format painter and click on this, but I want to format all three cards at once. And here's a little workaround for that. We can't just click on our visual, click on format painter, hold control and click on everything we want to format. Unfortunately, that doesn't work. But what works is if we just select these three visuals, and I just mark them like this. You could also click on one and then hold control pressed and click on the other three and then do right click group. Now, if you see, if I click on any of the three, all three are selected, they are group now. If I click now on my visual on format painter and then on the group, doesn't matter on which one of the group, all three will be formatted. And then I un group them again. So we can use the format to format another card visual or any visual in Power BI the same way as the initial one that we have. But we can also do that for a group of visuals, but then we need to group them. So maybe that's easy to remember. You need to group them to apply group formatting. Now, this does not only work for background and border and these kind of things. This also works for applied conditional formatting. Let's have a look. This is my column chart here. And you see it has a title, a subtitle. I have applied the conditional formatting here where I tell Power BI the highest wall value needs to be green, the lowest needs to be red, and everything in between needs to be gray. I can open this. It's in the columns. Here you can see my conditional formatting. And now you see here a visual. There's no formatting at all. This is just how it looks when you open Power BI, just drag and drop. There's no theme, nothing in there. So now if I click on my first visual, click on Format Painter and click on the second one, you see the conditional formatting is automatically applied. We have the lowest value, the highest value, everything in between. And I, if I open the settings in the Format Pane, I can see these my conditional formatting rules that I applied to the first one. So then of course it works because all the configuration is the same. We can just really use the format painter to do exactly the same. There is a chance that the conditional formatting isn't picked up simply because that option, that configuration option isn't in the second visual. And to show you that, I have here three visuals. Like the first one is the visual, I want that format. I want to apply that format. And the second one is a bar chart. I want to apply the formatting of the column chart to the bar chart. And I know there's some conditional formatting happening here. And we have a table. And I just want to show you what happens if I apply the formatting. So first click on the column chart, format painter, and click on the bar chart. You can see the same 
formatting is applied. Now, if I click on my column chart again, on the format painter and on my table, it doesn't look like a lot is happening. Now, if I click somewhere else, we see the background is applied and the border is applied, but otherwise, stuff is not applied. Why? Well, the formatting configuration of this column chart is very different from the table. If you open the format pane, you will see you have different options. They have different headers. So Power BI just simply doesn't know if I would like to apply like the conditional formatting, where would that exactly be and why? And we don't have any bars or columns in here, so it wouldn't make sense. You so that's the format pane that this little button here, like I said, you can use it on one visual. You just click on the visual, click on format paint and click on the visual that you want to format. You can use it on more than one visual, on multiple visuals by grouping the visuals first and then click on the first visual on format painter and then on the group. And you can also third point apply it to different visuals, but you need to understand that Power BI can only format what it knows to format because it was configured in the first visual. Let me know if this video helped. It took me forever to find this button and then I found it and I was like, whoa, this should be part of some training. Thank you for watching this.